what is going on guys my name is Ivani and you guys probably have been wondering where I've been because I haven't really been uploading a lot in the past two months exactly zero videos but I've kind of been bored uh, with playing video games over and over um, I have summer break and I have my days off so um, I actually got my motorcycle license a while ago and I got my first bike um, the guys in America you guys probably have seen this bike before especially when you look at the name if you see a green bike that says Ninja. It's probably a Kawasaki Ninja 300 and that's exactly uh, what this bike is. I put um, you know green rim striping on it and a different exhaust. Um, I will show you guys some clips of that but I basically wanted to show you guys the bike I bought um, kind of the details that I put onto it. Um, I plan on keeping this bike for two years and then I can get my full license so I can get a unrestricted one and I can basically get a Ninja uh, ZX 6R, that's kind of the bike that I'm looking towards. So, um, if you just look at my handlebars, they're still completely stock, even my levers or levers, they're still the stock ones. Um, I do have a phone case uh, for which I can put my phone in, it's exactly uh, 5.8 inches if I'm correct, so that this is for my phone. Then I have my um, remove before flight one on my key, which is, uh, you know, kind of dope. So, I, you know, I can always, you know, see where my keys, uh, keys are. Then, uh, my mirror is still stock ones. I don't really plan on um, getting new ones or different ones. I mean, I think those are perfectly fine. Then, um, I got a tank pad or a tank protector. It depends how you want to call it. Um, I don't know what this style is called. It's probably Barracuda or something. No clue at all. Um... And then, if you come to this side, you can see my phone. I don't want to stand in there. Those are the basic Ninja stickers. Then I have one GoPro on the back. I don't know how it looks, if it looks good or bad. Don't really know. I, um, I, I do like it on there because, you know, I record a lot with my GoPro because stupid things tend to happen. And then I have one of my T-Blade um, stickers on there and one on here. Now, I don't want to, you know, put my bike full with stickers because it looks absolutely ridiculous if you do that, in my opinion. But I think that those look fine on this side. And then you can see my lights, um, you know, my number plate is fine. It's a Dutch one anyway. Um, and here is my, you know, the GoPro, as I said, and then T-Blade. So if you look from this side, it looks like, you know, it kind of looks fine. And then you guys have seen my face before, um, but still my suit. Um, I can show you guys, you know, my suit. I don't know how, but uh, I will try and do. So if you go to my... Uh, tires, these are the ZX1R tires, I think from Pirelli, but I have no clue to be honest. I should look it up and if you look at my chicken strips, or however people like to call them, this is basically the part where I have been driving, you know, on the straight road, then to this part I have been driving in corners, and this little piece here, I haven't driven on that, so don't think my chicken strips are too bad, and same for this side. Now you can see can you see that with the lining? I have no clue. You know, my, my chicken strips on the right are a little bit bigger uh, and then they're on the left. Now, I cleaned my chain a few times already and I lubricated it quite often. You know, they say like every 300 miles or something, but that's fine. Um, now, of course, you guys want to hear the exhaust note, so that's what I'm going to show you guys next. I hope it's not too windy and I hope my camera can actually pick up the sound properly. Now, of course, it is not a stock exhaust. As you guys can see, it's a carbon fiber. And this specific exhaust, it still has a DB killer in it, uh, but it still makes way too much noise. Um, if you ask me, well, not too much, but you know, the sound levels are pretty, pretty high. This is a Delkovic 200 millimeter exhaust, um, and it's loud as hell. So I'm gonna turn it on, and I hope, there we go, all the flashy lights are then turning. I'm going to rev it up a little bit and then I hope you guys can hear it. So this is it with just idling and now I'm going to rev it up a little bit and I'm going to hold it you know, next to the exhaust. 